Does the stock market have you completely confused? Do the illogical market swings and volatility leave you scratching your head? Struggling to find deals in the sizzling real estate market? How are you supposed to navigate these treacherous roads with a normal investment vehicle? Most financial advisors only have knowledge of their traditional investment products. Most financial advisors will never match, let alone beat the market on a regular basis. What's worse is they make money even if they lose yours. You're probably thinking, okay professor, if you're so smart, what is the solution? The solution to your financial future definitely doesn't involve following the herd. You need to think of alternative investments and mimic the big financial players. And no one is bigger than the banks. So how do you become a bank? I became my own bank by investing in real estate notes. You're probably thinking, what is a real estate note and what is note investing? A note is a contract in the form of a promissory note that is secured by real estate. In essence, it is an IOU in the form of a loan that has to be paid off for a piece of property. The note will have terms like the amount owed, duration, regular payments, interest rate, and fees. So you start off by buying a loan from a bank. Congratulations, you're now your own bank. And like a bank, you now collect monthly payments from the borrower on their mortgage. You collect these payments until the note has been paid in full. Once you've been paid in full, you'll need to reinvest in another loan and start the process over again. However, that's not the only way to invest in notes. The previous scenario was an example of a performing note. It's called a performing note because the borrower is paying and performing their part of the contract. What happens when the borrower doesn't make their payments? This is called a non-performing note, and it offers a unique opportunity. Banks will often sell non-performing notes for a steep discount. Depending on the situation, they can be bought for roughly 25-40% to 40 of what is owed. Why would banks sell non-performing notes at such a big discount? Most banks are too big and have too much red tape to handle these problem notes. They want to get them off their books so they can then lend what money they do have to new borrowers. And that's where we come in. We buy these non-performing notes at a huge discount. And that provides us with the flexibility to make money and help borrowers. We can take the time and offer the borrowers the white glove treatment. We can forgive some of the past accrued debt, set up a new payment plan that's more affordable and in line with the current market values, negotiate to get the deed back from the borrower if they're unable to stay, Approve a short sale on the home so we can get cashed out and the borrower can move on. And finally, if we have to, we can foreclose on the borrower if they're unwilling to work with us. So in a nutshell, that's what note investing is. You're buying a mortgage or another promissory note that's secured by real estate. Here's a quick summary on the reasons you should invest in performing or non-performing notes. Performing notes offer a good discount, good yields, they're secured by real estate, they offer usually monthly cash flow. There's no tenants, no termites, and no toilets. Non-performing notes are at an even higher discount. They usually have higher yields because they're usually a little bit more risky. They are also secured by real estate. They offer great flexibility because you have such a huge discount. It's definitely an impact investment. You're having a positive impact on people's lives and communities across the United States. There's also no tenants, no termites, and no toilets. I'm Paul Cooper and I'm the manager of Totes and Notes. I'd like to thank you for your time for watching our short video. If you'd like to learn more about note investing or what we do, please text the word TOTES to 72000. You can also go to our website at www.totesofnotes.com and you can also reach me at my email, paul at totesofnotes.com.